Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So let's start with the bank nifty analysis. We'll look at the weekly, daily, 15 minute time frames. Okay. And then let's try to see what options can be sold. Next, I think uh, Nikita is going to record some shorts on the budget. I think please keep an eye out for that. And uh, do follow us on Instagram as well. And we'll be uploading it there as well. Okay, so first of all, bank nifty. Se chalu karte. Our best friend uh, Nirmala Sitaraman, she came out with a fantastic budget today. And the market has gone down 500 points approximately. Okay, so let's see if there's more fall in the coming days. Basically, everything is negative now. Positives, jo hai usme, like I need to search, like and I need to check if there are any positives or not. Because like she raised tax everywhere. So let's look at things from a technical point of view. Weekly chart, ko sabse pehle dekhte hai, okay? So see, observe this candle, this green candle. Okay, ye green candle ko observe. Now look at the lens through which I want to take you. In this green candle, the last three candles are more or less inside candles. Candles, okay, iske. and it seems to have broken on the downside now. And even if you ignore the jo green candle, usko ignore bhi kiya agar. just look at the last ke jo do candle the last ke dono week. This is an inside candle. Inside candle ka breakdown has come on the downside. So, in this case, mein, what can be predicted? Ye inside candle ke jo high ke levels hai, these levels should go to zero, logically speaking. Of course, I mean, if the if some news comes out or kuch interpretation agar nikalta hai, so this logic will go for a toss. But as of now, jo level pe hum bet kar sakte hai, easily I think 50 to 800 should go to zero. Even the today's candle, this week's high also should go to zero, I think. 50 to 500. Let's see, I don't see it crossing anytime soon. But you know, like our markets, in spite of such a bad news, Nifty is only down, I think, 30 points. So like, kuch bhi karo, like in this market, eventually buying comes. So my prediction can go wrong also, okay? But I think the calls should go to zero by tomorrow at least. Okay, so weekly candles se mujhe ka samaj mein aata hai. Very simple. I come to know inside candle breakdown has happened here. Okay, so weekly candle ko dekh ke bullish khel sakte ke abhi nahi khel sakte as of now. So when to play bullish, I think I'll cover them or I'll tell Nikita to cover it whenever she covers in her videos. As of now, I don't see anything to play bullish from the weekly point of view. Okay, let's look at the daily chart. I see a support here at 52,000 and another mini support near 51,700. So market has successfully closed. Now if you see this entire zone, okay, this zone which I have highlighted, observe the candle closing, only the closing, not the open opening not the high not the low so today's closing is the lowest closing in so many days okay so isko bullish nahi mante isko bearish hi mante correct so for me this has slightly bearish now and i think agar aaj ke low koi niche if it goes must down move it can come okay for me ek hi acha cheez kya hai matlab one thing which should have happened today but didn't happen 51750 ka jo support we had market has not closed below that if the market closed below that, I would be coming and giving you aggressive bearish views here. Okay, so just because that wick has come, I'm like hesitant to give like a super aggressive views now. Okay, so which strike should go to zero logically speaking. Again, I'm sharing my plan. Okay, so don't blame me if this goes wrong. This is what I am doing and I have done. I think today's high should go to zero. And if you want to play a safe bet, the 50 to 800 call should go to zero as per me. If you're a conservative guy, you can sell this $53,000 call. That also was trading around 18 rupees. So that gets you 0.33% in your capital if that goes to zero. So 50 to 800 to pakka zero jana chahiye. Aaj ka high bhi zero jana chahiye as per me. Okay. This wick will confuse us, but theek hai, abhi dur ke option we've sold. So let's see what happens. Correct. So I told you which options mere ko lagta hai zero jana chahiye. I told you daily candles ke hisab se, sab se lowest closing hai hai. Lowest closing is never bullish. Okay, it is bearish only. So when will market become bullish now? So abhi hamar analysis jo hai, hamesha wrong bhi ja sakta hai. Thik hai? Like we are not gods. So we need to know where will our view go wrong. Now someone like commented that I give dual views. That's because I don't know exactly what will happen. So I have to react. If the upside it breaks today's candles high, I am forced to play bullish. If it breaks today's low, I am forced to play bearish. So I don't have any view bullish bearish. I will just follow the market. So now let's look at where will things get bullish. Mere hisab se aaj ke high ke upar if the market goes, I think it's going to be very bullish then. This is a budget day. So budget day high and low become extremely crucial. Many times in the budget day ke baad na, like three, four days sideways hota hai market. Ab dekho. So let's see, I think tomorrow should be an inside candle. Okay, slight bearish bias ke saath. But if I'm wrong, I will be wrong above today's high. And after that, I think we can start buying. So aaj ke high ke upar, I want minimum one strong 15 minute candle closing there. So this basically becomes a resistance then. Okay, resistance ke upar, if we close like this, it's going to be pretty bullish then. 
आई हैव शेयर्ड माय एनालिसिस एज पर द डेली चार्ट सो लेट्स रीकैप वीकली चार्ट पर इनसाइड कैंडल ब्रेकडाउन डेली चार्ट पे लोएस्ट क्लोजिंग नाउ लेट्स लुक एट द 15 मिनट टाइम फ्रेम ओके सो ऑन द 15 मिनट टाइम फ्रेम दिस इज आवर रेजिस्टेंस द रेजिस्टेंस इज 50 टू 800 एंड द सपोर्ट इज 51 750. Cool. So market has come up and closed inside the support range. Now where will we play more bearish? अभी like अभी view तो bearish है, but we need to know where will we add our positions if things go as per us. Okay. So first of all, if according to me market should come down and break this low or do time pass. Okay. So most likely time pass I think. Today's low, if you get a 15 minute candle closing below this, it should not be the first 15 minute candle. Okay. बाकी कभी भी चलेगा. Then I think I'll add to my bearish positions and pyramid them. Okay. Cool. And usually no. I'll I'll tell tell you, you it's good to sit out on these even days. I'll tell you why? Because see, like even if you mark this as a support, so let's assume after this candle close, you've sold a call option. Okay, so this spike, no, it will scare you. It will take you out of your position. Correct? And, I mean, either you will book some loss or either you will end cost to cost. Either way, I think it's not worth it. I mean, you have. If you have not made money, I think you wasted your time. Try to avoid event days. And my problem is, I mean, I have to underestimate an event. वो एच डी एफ सी बैंक के दिन भी मुझे कुछ नहीं लगा होगा पुटिन के टाइम पे भी आई थॉट लेट्स टेक इट नथिंग विल हैपन आई हैव अ बिग प्रॉब्लम ओके विद इवेंट्स सो फॉर मी स्पेशली आई नो आई शुड नॉट बी डूइंग एनीथिंग ऑन इवेंट्स कुल अभी इवेंट इज डन दो सो आई एक्सपेक्ट दिस हाई टू गो टू जीरो टू डेज हाई एंड दिस सपोर्ट वॉज ब्रोकन विद अ वेरी स्ट्रॉग कैंडल लुक एट दिस बेरिश कैंडल करेक्ट सो आई थिंक इसके ऊपर ही नहीं आना चाहिए फिफ्टी टू वन हंड्रेड के ऊपर ऑल्सो आई डोंट इट्स वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर द मार्केट टू गो इफ इट क्रॉसेज दैट देन वी कैन लाइक बेसिकली इट से This low should go to zero then if the market goes above that. Cool, but I don't think it na easily it can do it. Okay, so 15 minutes pay now if if the market comes here and comes down, this is going to be resistance. So only after a higher high will we play bullish here. Okay, and on the upside, this resistance is going to act. Mala, we'll be holding our positions as this is a resistance. It is very far away, but the good thing is even if you sell that option, I think you can rake half a percent in at least. And Friday ko you might have made good money since six. Monday yesterday also you could have done something point one ka to kari sakte the. So this way. I think you can gobble up 0.7, 0.8, 0.91% in a week. Cool. So let's see tomorrow uh, for Bank Nifty. Abhi let's go for Nifty. So Nifty weekly time frame pe I see a rejection candle. I said can this be a top? Okay, in my thumbnail. Now below that weekly candle, it was bearish, but it has like regained upper. मतलब upper आ गया है अभी ये. So this shows a pin bar wick. A big wick. Okay, on the downside indicates bullishness. I am actually shocked that Nifty is not down. Like according to me, it should like close near the lows, especially after such a budget. I am actually shocked ये नहीं जा रहा है नीचे. ठीक है, but okay. So Nifty में I think better to keep bearish bias in Nifty unless market gives up at least a daily candle close above twenty four five hundred. Okay, then we'll see and add to your aggressive bearish positions below current week low. Cool. So daily chart पर same thing. Today's candle is very 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 bullish. मतलब this is a very strong bullish indication from Nifty. Never good though. मतलब This is very confusing for me because now this is a strong support twenty four one hundred. Why is it a strong support? Because two times market tested from there once and twice. Cool, very simple again. So basically, like you come to know twenty four one hundred के नीचे any time the market goes within the next one two three weeks, you have to play bearish. Don't play bullish then. And today's candle is a pin bar. So if the market comes down to yeah tomorrow, then it should basically trade inside this range, making an inside candle in Nifty at least. Okay, but this signifies an up move in Nifty. So next day probably should be a gap up and bank nifty is giving me a basically gap down to flat vibes so both are opposite views from the index which is again a red alert time do no things tell you opposite na try to stay away from aggressive trades from my experience i'm telling you both have to tell you the same thing agar nifty bhi bullish hai bank nifty bhi bullish hai pakka aapka trade sahi jane wala hai okay matlab bahut high chances hai uske bank nifty you are feeling bearish nifty you are feeling bullish the trade ka like sl hit hone ka chances very high then this is there's no hard like back testing on this just based on intuition and my uh, memory i'm telling you so nifty uh, bullish on the daily chart okay so today's low becomes important and uh, this red candles high becomes pretty important for us 24850 so market is showing some selling signs from there and market showed some buying signs today okay so inside this range i think market can go sideways for some time and then we'll see wherever it breaks out or breaks down we'll form a larger view okay nifty ka and 15 minutes pe see market took support from today 24000 levels okay so that should act as a strong support for us moving forward तो बेरिश अगर खेलना है अग्रेसिवली अग्रेसिव बेरिश शुड ओनली बी बिलो टू डेज लो बिकॉज दे स्ट्रॉग बाइंग ऑल्सो हैपन टूडे तो उसके पहले वी कैनॉट प्ले स्ट्रॉगली बेरिश एंड रेजिस्टेंस यू आर सींग इन दिस रेंज कल अगर बेसिकली फ्लैट 
फ्लैट खुल के इफ इट गोज डाउन देन आई थिंक इन दिस रेंज इट विल बी एन इन साइड कैंडल ओके एंड इफ इट क्रॉसेज द लास्ट टू डेज हाई फॉर मी इट्स गोन बी बुलिश निफ्टी बिकॉज टूडे ऑल्सो द बाइंग वॉज अ वी शेक रिकवरी दिस वी शेप रिकवरी एंड देन अ ब्रेकआउट विल बी प्रिटी बुलिश इन निफ्टी एंड वी कैन एक्सपेक्ट सम स्मॉल रेजिस्टेंस नियर द एटीएच ओके सो कूल लेट मी नो इफ दीज व्यूज हेल्प यू एंड आई एम गोन टू स्टार्ट राइटिंग थ्रेड ऑल्सो अगेन एंड ऑल्सो लाइक डू द शॉर्ट पार्ट ऑफ इट कूल सो थैंक यू सो मच फॉर दिस वीडियो आई सी यू वेरी सुन बाय